Here. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, oh, oh. I can't, I can't, I can't. Hi everyone, welcome back after lunch. Uh, I hope you have uh, enjoyed your lunch. Uh, and right now we're gonna start to the, our uh, topic today, high speed parsing mass, massive uh, XML Ruby from uh, uh, the director and CTO at Dot Run Inch from Japan, uh, Mr. Hiloka Tessia. Welcome. Hello, I'm Cynthia Hirota at Top Running in Japan. I will speak high speed, uh, high speed parsing active XML in Ruby. Be faster than five sample code. Yes. In this presentation, what version I have done at Ruby World Conference. 2023 in Japan. Today I'll tell you more about it. What I'm going to talk about today, I was I was requested uh, to convert massive XML to JSON in Ruby and was provided with item sample call. However, if I parse and convert it normally, it took more than four times as long as a sample call. So I created something like to Python to parse in Ruby, combined with uh, combined it with Raptor and made it thirty percent faster. Than Python sample call. Today it's separate. And today's content uh, introduction, I will speak self introduction, my company introduction. And for, uh, in product, what is my project? How about parsing normal and Python toppers in making what I tried and how to make some like Python top bars using 
how to use InnoPulse with Mokogi, Ox, and Tractor. May I have a moment for discussion? My name is Tetsuya Hiroka. I serve as CTO at Dr. Ning. I'm from Shizuoka City, Japan. My job, uh, what I've been spending a lot of time, a lot of time uh, recently on depending on uh, developing applications using deep learning for our clients which has been quite interesting, but I don't talk about it. I remain dedicated to our, uh, our core work in bioinformatics database development and volunteered programming co a course mainly for children of held a lifelong learning course at Nohara City in Japan. And document export type. Database construction with valuable insight into the space of the life science database. Robust retrieval system and visualization tool. We understand what types of touch and irrigation are demanded by the life science community and how to effect. Then. And today's focus part of the, of the ongoing bioinformatics database development. We are the challenge to high speed parsing mask XML. Today I'll be predicting the outcomes and insights we gain from this project. When I parse the massive XML, some problems were offered. At first, what is BioProject? They are a public database for bioinformatics. Bio Sequence, uh, sequence data such as genomes and RNA are registered in the public databases with related metadata such as paper information, experimental conditions, and samples. BioProject is a part of public databases. BioProject is metadata collection about sequence analysis project, and this metadata provides Things with many related information, including paper information. The format of the project is simple XML file. The XML is over 2 gigabytes in size. Contains 700,000 records of information, and it's growing every day. Problem. The search patterns provide public data environment are limited. Performing complex searches on XML, such as the needs of researchers, it's a lot of time. And, and I also want to handle a large XML biosample. The XML, including sample information, is over. 70 gigabytes. Parsing normally. First, I tried parsing bio, bio project XML using, using normal method. Array XML. Array XML. Wrote in Tamar and no response. No kogiri. No kogiri. It, it took 35 minutes and used over 10 gigabytes of memory. This support and for the over time. I need a 
it is considered a slow because it loads all, all, all objects into memory and searches for extra. I'll talk about uh, talk about it more detail on the next page. Python sample code using it offers it takes eight minutes plus. Each element in the first area is lazily loaded. Is an abbreviation for Biopact XML. Top level is the package element. No. And second level is the project element. One of the project element is 100 kilobytes per 10 megabyte in size. 700,000 projects. Uh, elements living by project XML. First, normally extract all elements all into memory. It also requires memory served serve several times the size of XML. Extract from all projects. Searching data from a large tree extracted memory. All objects extracted in memory. Also, takes time up for some search. Parsing by Python to parse, extract to memory for each project element. Allocate memory for each project and the it is after after watching in JSON. So no need to use a lot of memory. Convert small three project to one JSON one JSON in JSON L. Search scope is limited and processing time processing time is reduced. Of course, it's good, but I can't find, it, but can't find in Ruby, like the forest. So I made it, named in a forest. Make in a forest. I decided to make in a forest. How did I make it? Converting strategy. A converting. Uh, I decided to divide, divide it into three parts. The first one, lazy loads the first level element. This is the enum parse. The second part parse it split elements. The normal parse was the third one converts converts to the first XML application and output it. I summarize what I tried when making in a forest. The split part was normal string, string operation, local tax, ox tax, and live XM tax. The first part was RXML, Nokogiri, and the hot and with Raptor. First, I tried RXML without split. As I told earlier, RXML has frozen. Next, I tried Nokogiri without split. I, as I told earlier too, this was time consuming and required a lot of memory. 
Next, I tried it by split, splitting it with string operation. String operation was slow and didn't get any faster. I couldn't get it to be any faster. So I decided that when I split it with, split it with no hogiri sack and first it with no hogiri, it became reasonable to have. Here. To make it even faster, I split it with no hogiri sack and first it with ox and it Game as an example for using a top art. Here. By the way, Ruby has raptor. I consider speed up speeding up process and performing parallel processing with raptor. This student Nokogiri inside raptor. I ran off the JSON output. As a result, I was able to get Nokogiri running in eight minutes. And I split with Nokogiri sat first with Ox and output S with Raptor. And it was completed in six minutes. It's here. And next, Oxsax was unfortunate with last five not fast. And finally, I split it using libxml sack, first it with Ox, and put JSON with Raptor, and I was able to process it in five minutes and 34 seconds. It's here. In addition, my PC is Ryzen 5 CPU and 10 gigabyte RAM. Type of more is very bad. Let's talk about the details. Making real force sucks. String operations. Extracts the range from the start tag to the end tag of an element using a string operation. I create the buffer that stores one megabyte each, such it for the start and end tags using finding the instance and extract them. It might have been faster to eat one byte each, but it didn't seem like it be that significantly. So I decided to come up with another method. So yes, using that, what is that? Simple API for XML. Prompt is a random access API. That's with Rick. Sequential access API. That's with a document sequence from the being and transmission to the application with events. And that's with Boolean with the first layer of project and using Nokogiri stack and the first by Nokogiri take 30 minutes with chart chart this is Nokogiri stack's code 
Teaching no Hobby Start, start Element is an event handle that runs when the element starts here. Elements with this same name may appear different layers. So count step of elements with the same name. Elements were stored in string IO buffers at when when the element broke, current buffer string to the original process five or reuse. I'm going to use it. How to use Nokogiri in the past with Nokogiri? Here is a sample of Project XM of JSON Converter. It must provide Project XM, I Project XML JSON method. Use Nokogiri as a person. In my implementation, conversion details go here. Generate enumphors from enumphors out enumphors out JSON for the active element. The opposite task couldn't be possible. Part. I found a library that can parse faster. Ox. Here is URL of either right side chart. Parsing seems to twice as fast. Here. I change the parsing part to ox and try it. It takes eight minutes. It passed at five and top or sample. Change factor from Nokogi to Ox. Interface production of Ox is different from usual. It expands. Rewrite the conversion details for Ox. Generate any numerator. Now for a particular chain. Now we in the same process time as Python code completed. And last time a Python topper at speed of I think the first same at speed. But Ruby has locked the same mechanism in Python, but the powerful localized mechanism of Ruby. I think so site use it because it runs fast Python. Enum force does propagate you guys are. Both use for the 
and I want it, of course, to last probably a bit faster. Structure is one of the prioritization mechanisms in Ruby. And Python doesn't have the same mechanism. Raptor processing further covering without being blocked by the other. Reading, parsing, and writing in parallel, parallel structure, making it faster. But first of all, no degree can be parallelized by Raptor. Some error has occurred, but security. So, parallelize only writing, but it be faster, eight minutes. If you are using Nokogiri, I recommend you see. Raptor is very good, parallelized mechanism. However, Raptor has many restrictions for safety and cost of distance creation time. So we have to think about to use it efficiently. And I create Rakta instance only once. There is only one. First with JSON, writing the output Receive a JSON string asynchronously and output it the file in the rock thread. In a first class rock. focusing on speed, I tried a production box. Re reusing rock thread, parallelizing, parallelized by rock. Parallelize reading, parsing, and reading run main thread. Parsing and writing run throughout those thread. Very fast, about six minutes. If it parallelized, the CPU usage would naturally, naturally increase. Writing Raptor remains at the edge. Focus can parallelize by Raptor. So create a Raptor instance for parsing and pass writing, writing Raptor's argument. That's why Raptor cannot handle external variables. Here. In the thread, pass the XML element. A string sequentially dot with enum parse to parse factor. Why change that? But working by ox is very fast. Maybe fast reading by ox of the tax. I thought. So I try to change the ox tax. Unfortunately, it was slow, despite parallelized reading, parsing, and writing even took over eight minutes. Local theory not be installed due to dependency. Therefore, I create in a port using LibreX and SAX version. You can parallelize reading, parsing, and writing. It it passed there five minutes thirty four seconds time. If you are using Nokogiri, I using if you are not using Nokogiri and focusing on speed, I recommend this group only change total require and that new part of. And I release not pregnant parse and believe XML in office. 
review example in your course was released uh, the day before yesterday. It's not easy to prevent review external, review external errors on Windows. So currently only Linux sub Linux only Linux sub it may be it may also work but also Linux XML in a first faster. That may be stop the OS different. I could have no for you in a person. Thank you for your attention. Good. Welcome your patient. Thank you. Thank you so much for your sharing. And uh, we are at step two QA part. Do you have any question for him? Don't be shy. <laughs> So you mentioned initially that memory for normal part. Memory you see. Memory is basic. And prioritizing? Yeah, after prioritizing. Oh. Okay. About twice size. What speed is up there? How much the number? No paralyzing. I about two gigabyte. Hey, thank you, your answer, and thank you, your question. Anyone have a question now? We still have a little bit of time here. See that you... <laughs> oh, okay. Um... <laughs> so you have... Did you... Uh, try any other Ruby implementations, uh, uh, JRuby, which could do it all in parallel without Ractor. I didn't try it. Try that. I'd like to. I'd like to try it and help and see what we can do. Top taking Rust made to be extension. Thank you. Thank you so much for your answer. Anyone have a Do you want to? What uh, did you learn using Rector? Did you learn anything interesting while you were learning uh, using Rector? Um, was there any learnings you had? Or any like um, gotchas, like gotchas, um, anything interesting?
<laughs> yeah, yeah, you can meet it later. And so that, uh, anyone have question? You know? So it sucks, right? Can you ask it to limit the event that it gives you? You must get events for all the, no. Or can you say, for example, give it uh, X path or something to match on and say, give me only events. Uh, can sex filter the events for you, or you have to filter it yourself? <laughs> Anyone speak Japanese? <laughs> you can. Yeah, so we can help him to translate it. A lot of. So maybe we can use Google Translate. Yeah. <laughs> uh, talk about after. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, do you want any of you have? Him? Uh, we can ask him later. <laughs> yes, no problem. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. So much. Yeah. Thank you very much. Uh, so we're gonna have like a ten minute break from now to the next uh, speaker. Uh, we can go to toilet to relax. Thank you. <laughs>